Hi guys, welcome to Book of Shayla and welcome to day nine of 30 Days of Sketches with Christy's Beautiful Life Series 15. Today's sketch is a double pager and it is by Stella Harris. Hers is a beach page. I'm going pretty much as opposite as possible and doing a Christmas page. When I have double um, page sketches, I'm always thinking about Christmas because I always have so many Christmas pictures. And so that is what I'm going to do. Now, I have done a lot of work ahead of time because I knew this one was going to take me a while. So let me show you what I did. I took the Close to My Heart. Oh, what's the name of this collection? Comfort and Joy collection. I had um, not a whole lot left. And actually, this one is not from there because I needed a blue paper. And the only, I did not have... A big enough strip of blue in that collection so I pulled a um, strip from another close a really old close to my heart collection but I cut them in one inch strips because sh hers is um, striped and then I put this paper this poinsettia paper and split it between the two now I have three pictures now she said these were four by four but they looked skinnier than they did wide and so i did three by fours and these three are of my husband and then she had two two by twos uh photos and then two two by twos like embellishment squares and i just did these two photos in two by four probably or so maybe threes let's see are they about that same height a little smaller than that actually so I'm just going to do these. These are of my daughter and son passing out presents. Then on this side, she had two four by fours. And this is me with the blender I got. And then this is Garrett's high school girlfriend opening her present. And so I did that. And then over here, I have three more three by fours. And I have me seeing my daughter open her a present, my son opening a present, and then my mother-in-law opening a present. Now these pictures here um, are supposed to look like film strips. So I went and um, cut some film strips from my die, but they're not long enough. So I'm gonna have to, I cut them in half and then I'm gonna double them up. So but I needed to get my pictures down first. So let's do that first. I know you might not be able to see the whole thing, but I think you can see enough to see what I'm doing here. Oh, the holes keep popping out. Oh, uh, where's my little thing? And where's something I can put it on. Okay, so I was going to put this down like so. And then I'm going to scoot this over a little bit so I can and then overlap it. just so those will even up and make a little cut here and there's that side and if you look close you're going to be able to see that I pieced it together but I don't think anybody's going to be looking that close and if they are and they notice it well you know what too bad <laughs> I'm not going to worry about it Uh oh, nope, nope, nope. Hold on. I'm going to have to turn this so I can get it in there right. Yeah, 
these people, you know, there's so many people that do their Christmas layouts like right after Christmas and it just amazes me that they're that organized because I cannot do Christmas. I mean, I, I hardly ever do Christmas during Christmas. I mean, I kind of do sometimes, but not very often. I just, I'm not that ahead of the game or with the game, I guess, that I am in the right season at the right time. Okay, so there's that. That doesn't look too bad. And like I said, it can, you can kind of tell, but I'm fine with it. All right, now let me glue these down. I'm gonna leave just a little bit of space between them. Okay, so there's that side. Now, let me show you the embellishments I have. I, because this week, um, well, actually, last week, my product, when I made these page kits, my product focus was um, close to my heart stamps. And so I've stamped some presents. Um, in three different eats, avocado, New England, ivy, and glacier, and on the, the paper, the um, pattern paper. So I'm gonna kind of stick these around. She has a cluster here and a cluster here. Um, I don't want that one though. There, okay. Then, um, I also have to use enamel dots. That's this week's um, product focus. So I'm going to use enamel dots. I also have some, these are the, I have some, they're stickers. And I need a title, but Joy, that would work. And she has it going down here. So I'm going to just do that. Let's see. Um, I want this to be at the six because that's halfway. And then I'll put the J here. Or do I want it closer together? Let's see what it looks like. And the Y. Here. Hmm, first off, my O is not uh, straight. I can tell that. That's one problem. So do I like it that spread apart? I think I want it a little bit closer together. Maybe, oh, please come up. Ah, it tore up a little bit. That's okay, though. Um, more like this, I think. Yeah, I like that better. It was just a little too far apart for me. Okay, so there's my title. I do not have very many um, stickers left. I have a couple of banners, one that says Silent Night, a couple of labels, um, a bow, Comfort and Joy, a few gold trimmed ones, a flower, a dove, a snowflake. So I am just going to go ahead and pick a couple of things and just stick them down because I would like to use this collection up as much as possible. So I'm gonna take this red label and put it up here for my base. And then my um, present, my gift is gonna, stamp is going to go in the corner here like so okay and then um let's see I think I could do the poinsettia maybe that should have gone down first of course like 
so you can still see that label so I didn't completely waste it okay I like that and then down here I'm gonna use this as a label I'm just gonna cover up this silent night because I don't know I just don't feel like I need something that says silent night so I'm just gonna go like this put this present down like so and then I also have um, some flare so I think I'm gonna put a flare here and maybe that may be it oh I also have these okay let's see um, I can do they're hard to see when they're on the gold side so I always flip it over gonna add one of these little poinsettias and one of the gold dots so add a poinsettia and a gold dot down here like so I need to put something gold up there I wonder about the leaf there's a leaf Maybe. In the bum, 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 bum. Don't know that I like that. Okay, what else could I put? I could put a bow, I guess. Let's see. Like that. Okay. All right, so that's this page for now. So let's come over to the other page. I know this isn't glued down. I'm gonna be really careful and set it somewhere that maybe won't get messed with. All right, now the second page, let's pull it. Now I've got to glue these down first, so. And she has a cluster down here, but we'll get to that in a second. Okay, same thing with the tape or the film strips. Actually, that evens up pretty well. I'm just going to leave it like that and not cut it. Oh, except this little thing needs to go under there. Okay. Do it again on the other side. And I cannot remember where I got my film spit die. I was in, I kind of went through a phase where I was buying dies all over the place. And I bought some on Timu and I bought some on Sheen and I bought some from Spectrum Art Creates. I bought some on Amazon, so I don't know where this one came from. Unfortunately, I can't tell you. I bought some on Etsy. <laughs> I said, I just bought them from all over the place, so I don't know where this one came from, sorry. Let's see if I can get lucky and do it the same way where I don't have to cut it. Oopsie. Come back here like so it's 
a little short, but that's okay. All right, so there is the film strip. Okay, she has a cluster here. So let me get my presents out. Okay, cluster. She has a cluster here. And she has a cluster up here. Ew. Oh, yeah, I'll use my white one. Then I'll just have one present left over. Okay, so there's the gifts. Um, what else do I have? I wonder if I could do that. That doesn't look too bad. And then I have a tree. Maybe I could use the tree here. Okay. And then I have another poinsettia for up here. All right, so there's the gold. And I have some gold dots I might go through and add. Let's look at my stickers. Oh yeah, I can add this here for this label for my base. So let me do that. Okay. And then, um, I'm going to add this one over here to make it look like, just like that. Yeah, add a little red. And I'm going to do the same thing up here behind this to add another little base, like so. All right, so there's... And like I said, you might not even be able to see it very well, but okay. So I have all that is good. Um, I don't really want the snowflake. I could use the bird, but I don't know. I just think it would be the dove, the bird. It's a dove. I know it's a dove, but I don't know. I think I'm finished with the sticker sheet. So then let me look here on my, um, I have two more flare so let's add a ho 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 down here and let's add this argyle up here and then i have a couple of holly leaves that i could also use from bramble fox and i have a tree too but it broke i wonder if i can i somehow make it look like no i can't No, and it's, yeah, I'm just not gonna. So I have this. So is there anywhere that I could put the holly leaves? I might could do it up here with the poinsettia. I wish they weren't going the same direction. Nope, if I did it here and here, I mean, that's kind of getting close to our faces. I just don't, nope, I don't think I'm going to have them either on here. Let me, can I add them here where my... Where this poinsettia is. And those are awful big for that little bitty poinsettia. And I have holly leaves there. What about on this poinsettia? I really want to use these, can you tell? One there. And one... There, what does that look like? I just don't like, I want them together. What if, oh, hold on, I got an idea. Now I know holly leaves are supposed to be, or holly are supposed to be red, but what if I did holly 
berries. Maybe like this. I don't know. I don't know. I guess I don't know what it's supposed to look like because I'm having like that maybe overlap them. I don't know. I just don't like, I really want one going like this, but it's not made to do that. Hmm. <laughs> See, I just keep putting it like that, and it doesn't go like that. And that's my problem. That's what's given me the fits here. You guys are probably like, just put it somewhere, Shayla, or get over it. Yeah, I know. Nope, it's just not gonna work. It's just not going to work. I need to just forget it. Okay, so. I've left enough here that I can stamp the date. I think I'm gonna put a little gold down here too, just to add a little gold there. And I have, now that I've punched these out, I could put Oh, I've got to do enamel dots too. Um, do I have any Christmassy ones? Oh, these would work probably. Um, big. Medium, small. I kind of want to put one in the middle of the poinsettia. Like that. And then, big, medium, small. Okay, so there's that side. Oh, sorry, sorry about that weird noise. I was then big medium. Small. Go back to big, medium. Oh, that was small. Medium. Small. And I'm going to use the small one that I pull it off. To go here in the tag. Okay, and then big, medium, and small. Like that. And that is going to do it. So I'm going to glue this all down. I'm going to stamp the date. At the end, there will be a still shot. And thank you so much for joining me. I know it still took me a long time, even though I did a lot of it not on camera, but that's okay. So thanks for joining me, guys. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up down below. If you want to see the rest of my 30 days of sketches, hit that subscribe button and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.